Hey guys, welcome to my YouTube channel. In this video, let's learn how to implement softmax activation function using Python NumPy. So softmax activation function is a neural network activation function that will be generally used as a last layer of neural network. So the even values of input that is k possible values. So that as an input to the softmax. So it will convert it into a probability distributed across 0 to 1. So if you add all the k possible probability values that will be equals to 1. So yeah, so this is a this is how a softmax activation function works. So let me show you with an example here. Yeah, so here is an example image where your uh, neural network is already trained to identify the difference between cat, dog, then elephant and uh, zebra. So yeah, so your neural network is already trained. So given the input image as cat, so it will try to find the or get the matching score that is uh, dog matches 20%, then cat matches with the cat that is 30%. Then elephant matches with the cat that is 12% and zebra matches with the cat as 5%. So this is the matching score that is k possible values that will be your input to the softmax. So once you get these values, so you will be feeding it to a softmax activation function. So that will give you the probability. So if you see the cat matching the cat, it is approx uh, 0.99. So that is exactly 1%. So that means the event of occurring a cat is 1. So that's how softmax activation function works. So yeah, so let's look into the activation function and then try to implement this using Python. Let me remove this image. Yeah, so here is a softmax activation function where softmax of uh, z equals to exponential raised to the power of z divided by the sum of uh, k possible values up to k so that is exponential raised to the power of z so this is the softmax activation function so let's try to implement it using python so let's import the required library so i'll be importing matplotlib i'll use pyplot let's give some name as plot and now let's try to i need numpy library so let's import that let's give some name as np so now let's take the same values as numpy array the values that we got from the image so that is uh, dog matches 20% cat matches 30 then elephant 12 and uh, zebra 5 so these are the values that I'll be using and uh, yeah, so we are converting a list to an array over here and storing it into a variable x. So now let's take y values. So we have to calculate the softmax. So that is uh, numpy dot exponential. So this is the first parameter. So let's give x and I have to divide it by the numpy that sum of uh, the complete that is k values so let's use numpy dot exponential of uh, let's use x here yeah so this is the implementation of uh, softmax so it's a one line code and now let's try to print it print the value of x and also print the value of y and uh, now let's try to plot a bar chart for this let's use plot dot bar and uh, i have to give x and y values and width of the bar is 0 0.5 so that it will be visible so now let's show the graph that is a bar graph yeah so this is the complete implementation of uh, softmax activation function using numpy so let me run this program and let's see how it works so running the main
yeah so here you can see the x values 20 let me move this yeah so here you can see the values of x are same so for y values you can see the first value 4.5 raised to the power of minus 5 so this is exactly 0 or approx 0 you can say and this next value that is 9.99 so that is exactly 1 and these two values that is uh, 1.522 and uh, 1.38 so these are also approx 0 so if you add this it will sum up to 1 so first value is 0 second value is approx 1 that is 0.99 and second and third values I'm sorry the third and fourth values are also 0 that is 0 1 0 0 that is a y values so here if you see in the bar chart so you can see that 30 is approx 1 so that is a probability it is approx tending to 1 and uh, remaining values for uh, that is 20 12 and 5 so you can see the values are that is a bar graph is not at all visible and only for the 30 so you can see the bar graph so yeah so this is the simple implementation of uh, softmax activation function let me close this closing this yeah so that's it in this video hope you liked it thank you for watching bye